You're good. System, this might actually translate to better. Start fighting. Yeah, but I mean, it's slightly different as far as like you know, character levels. happened last session or two uh so we went or well, we came back from our long ass journey uh <laughs> from the burnt out fucking hellhole and on our way back we got hit by more hunters and mix was bandits and we made it back, and boom. Well, we also talked to that merchant guy, right? Nobody cares. Nobody cares about the merchant. I, I thought everyone loved Hans. <laughs> All right. Uh, okay. And now, in between sessions, Odloff, you received a letter I did. Um, from Jonathan instructing you to bring the package to a set of coordinates. Yes. And I carried on that information to Zach, since Zach has known about this since the first letter I have received. That you did. Um, Zach received some information um, from going to confront Sadith kind of about this, that Jonathan was recently killed on a hit on his bar on all evidence points that it was someone higher up in the Bratva collecting a debt on the man. And that is where we will begin. Cool. Deep breath. Okay. What is the uh, DC for uh, suppressor? Uh, to here? Yeah. Uh, just imposes disadvantage. Uh, just disadvantage? Yep. All right, well. Well, I'm assuming um, she's is on the roof since uh, Preach basically read the, raised the red flag and had everyone in battle positions. What's up, brother? 
Yeah, what, do you, um, what are you guys going to do now? <laughs> well, Olaf uh, is just hanging out by the door. Zach, Our two here. leaders are basically preaching Zach, so... What were you saying, Preach? That, do you take the lead on this one? What do we do? Fuck, man. Uh... Fucking have an overwatch and, I don't know, probably send out a small patrol. Basically operate this shit like a fob. Okay. So I take it I'm overwatch? Yep. <laughs> so you, got, you guys are staying in town? I mean, until we get other news or... Okay. Um, so, so we're not going you... to those coordinates to investigate? I didn't even know about coordinates, so... I know. What about me, me, me oh, he has a sudden thing. No, no, we don't know anything about those. The only person the only person that knows anything besides me is Zach. That's right. Shiza has no idea what the fuck's going on, because... Nope. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, I'm just going to go ahead and tell Preach about the whole coordinates thing, too, because I'm going to be honest, I had totally forgotten about that. Ah, good fucking job. <laughs> Way to go, P.L. Yeah. <laughs> Love you, too. Love you, too. All right. So, Zach, um, you want to preach? I guess I'm going to tell Zach I think we should investigate honestly and i'm going to agree all right um preach roll me a quick um wisdom like straight wisdom or what do you want me to you want me to roll you an insight what do you want uh insight history or straight wisdom um you're not sure but something about those coordinates sticks out to you Okay. Uh, uh, then I'm going to guess I'm going to pull out a map of the area since I'm pretty sure we have that. Yes, you got it. And, no, uh, excuse me, you guys do. Plot where these are at. All right. Um, from studying the map, roll me an insight now with advantage. All right. So you are able to deduce from your memory and seeing it now on a map, those coordinates um, coincide with a ancient ruined cathedral. Um, bell slingers held this spot to be somewhat important to their order, um, but it's also been known to be used for meeting points between groups of people, um, people seeking shelter because it is quite a large and relatively fortifiable building. Okay. Uh, as soon as I figure out where it's at, I'm just gonna go, son of a bitch. What's up, dude? I'm gonna look up at Zach and be like, I know this place. I, I know where this is. Oh. Well, that's good. It can be, and it also can't. Good. Sure or is good. Who knows? Let's go find out. Schrodinger's I... Ambler site. Yeah. <laughs> um, Z, real quick, uh, the hatchet. What did we discern what its uh, attack was? It's a 1d10 plus strength. 1d10 plus strength? Yes, sir. Alrighty. Alright. And it's slashing, right? Yes, it is. I got a question. Mm-hmm. Do personal radios still exist? Because I couldn't see them in gear. Very rarely. Oh, so maybe if like, you're the Fourth Reich. Yeah. <laughs> pretty, pretty much, if unless it, pretty much unless you're like the regulators, um, some groups of Bratva, Nova Ruthenia, the Fourth Reich, or some of the other factions that exist in more developed areas, then no. That being said. If you guys set off today, it will be roughly about noon, meaning you guys will arrive about nightfall. 
Roger. That's and, that's actually perfect. Uh, just before we leave, I'm going to buy some more stems. All right. Uh, military grade. Uh, one military grade stem will cost you three hundred. Okay, never mind. I will not do that. <laughs> I will buy regular stem. One twenty-five. One twenty-five for one. For one. Okay. You're you're in uh, you're in the hospital towns. Their medical supplies are a dime a dozen. Did I? Shit. Okay, fine. All right, you can obtain five stem packs. For 625. Yes, you may. For a total of six stems. Nice. Make sure you get spelled um, too. Yeah. Uh, painkillers? Uh, painkillers will be 65 cap for one bottle. Uh, are there any buggies in town? Vehicles? Um, there are. Not to use for combat, but to get to this area quicker. There definitely are. Uh, um, what What is available right now? You can contract out a... Basically, two dune buggies will be enough to transport the party to the area. And if you do so, they are not armed. Okay. Um, you will also have to pay the cost of the buggy if it is destroyed okay. and obviously return alive what about uh, vehicles to own um you will be able to purchase a, a buggy if you so choose um but it will be quite expensive how expensive uh it's 3110 all you got yeah yeah, they're gonna, it's going to run you about 2,500 caps to buy the whole thing. Okay, yeah, no, never mind. Uh, um, what? Renting will be 250 per. 250 per buggy? Mm-hmm. How, how long will it take us if we walk? Uh, if you walk, the site is actually relatively close to uh, Kaibakin. Um, if you walk, you will arrive. Uh, you guys set out about noon. You guys will arrive about ten, ten thirty. With the buggies, just due to the rough terrain, you're looking more arriving about sundown. Okay. So about a, I'd say four, three, four hour difference. Okay. Yeah. No, we'll just fucking walk. Okay. It hasn't killed right. us yet, so. Yeah. And... If it's not broken, don't fix it. Yeah. Uh. Uh. Rounds wise, how much would it cost for a belt of, uh, shredder rounds for the MG? For the for the MG forty two. Yes. All right. So one second, I can actually. Calculate this specifically. Um, those are base price of three. You're buying a belt of 100? Yes. Fifteen hundred. Fifteen hundred. Fifteen hundred caps. Done. 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 All right, you have a you have one belt of a hundred shredder rounds. Oh God! For the MG forty two. Um, what other rounds are there? Shit. There's AP tracer. Assuming you're looking for rifle caliber. Yeah. Um, incendiary. How much for a uh, hundred rounds of uh, 306 shredder? 306 shredder would be the same price. 1500? Yep. Done. All right. 
It's funny because I can do that. Oh, we I know. You also have like what, like 110 cap left. So yeah. wait, did we only rent these buggies? No, we don't have buggies. Fuck we, those buggies. We're walking. You guys are hoping it. Oh. Uh, I was gonna say we could mount the climbing no, worker on it. Yeah, we look like something out of Mad Max. You could. What, a, what a wonderful day! You could, but if the buggy gets destroyed, you have to pay for it. Yeah, Witness! 2500. Witness me! <laughs> Alright. <laughs> that's the last of the housekeeping, though? I'm good. Yeah. Alright. So, you guys set off about noon. Go ahead, and whoever's leading, roll me that survival check. Alright. Wait, I don't have the coordinates, so... I'm... <laughs> the desert shirt, but I'm pretty sure they gave you the coordinates. Okay. There it is. Well, you managed to lead them there quite well. Um, you are successful in reaching the church. With no random encounters. Nice. Do not worry, the tokens are already placed. Bottom of the map. You can adjust your positions any way you so choose. Hold on. I'm looking. Trying to figure out where we are. Just thing, so. I got all black. We never, we never fixed your token. Oh, we've never fixed right. my token. Hmm. Uh, what's your dark vision? Sixty feet. Sixty feet. All right. All right. There you go. There we Would go. Would I be able to position myself up here instead? Yeah. Pretty much, you guys can't go past that little boulder that was just. You start out. Brutus is alone and unafraid. He just goes. Uh, let's see. Where's a good place to snipe from? <clears throat> yeah, I'll move over here onto this rock. Son of a bitch. All right. So. As you guys approach the ruins of this ancient cathedral, it is a smaller cathedral, one of the smaller ones that exist. Um, but due to its small size, it's weathered well. Its walls are fairly standing, despite some other, you know, ruins to it. The doors have kind of rotted away and fallen in on the front. Um, some of the bricks are falling out. But the structure still looks fairly stable enough. Enough that if you guys came across this in your adventures out of the ways, you would not pass it up to shelter. So, you, where can we not move our tokens past? Uh, Brutus or Zach. Okay. Uh, you mind if I roll stealth? You feel free. Hey guys, if you have any questions or anything, I just will. make sure to leave a comment or shoot them up in the message. I'll be able to answer them for you. Perception. All right. Waste. Looks the cathedral. It looks nice. It's a nice night. Is it more run down than what I remember it to have been? Uh, yeah, but that's just because of it's, wear and tear. You know, yeah. The last time you saw this was like decades ago. I'm gonna knock out a quick stealth as well. Okay. Set. You guys can go ahead and throw me up initiatives so we can move in a turn order. Yes, sir. <laughs> Jesus. Did <laughs> I put that in? Son of a bitch. Five. All right. 
So Zach, you are first. Imagine that. Uh, I'm just going to do... Uh, we're going to skip up to boop up up to here and just uh, do the old, old perception. All right. So as you go up, you can see that the cathedral is, like I said, it's very old, very decrepit. You're really not making out anything out of the ordinary to even other scout sites you have been to. Um, the only thing I will play with your perception is for you personally, this is not a place you would choose to scav, as probably the only thing found inside of the communion wine and holy books. Very well. She's up. Uh, I'm going to use a, a bonus action to look through my scope, try to perceive stuff. All right. And here we go. 27. All right, with a 27 perception, I will give you that the inside of the cathedral, as you're looking in um, and around it, through some of the holes in the roofs, you do see some small uh, uh, whiffs of smoke coming up, as if there's fires lit inside. I can see the fires. I mean, I can see into the buildings from where I am. Oh, that's right, you got a really long line of sight. Um, yeah, you can also <laughs> see... Whatever you can see, you can also see as well. Oh, okay. so there are so some fires lit inside. Okay. I don't see anybody hiding or anything? Nope. Okay. Uh, in that case, mind if I... I can't sight in unless I have something to sight in on, can I? Correct. Okay. Can I take an aim action and... Oh, well, two aim actions. Why not? All right. Budlov. All right. Budlov's going to... Oh, thank you. Here. And I'll throw up. Yeah, everything's good. Yep, everything's hunky-dory. And I'm good. Preach. Uh... Oh my god, it's at five minutes. That's awesome. Uh, and I'm going to go. Going prone takes how much movement? Uh, just if you're dropping prone, doesn't take any movement to belly flop to the ground. Yeah, I'm just doing All right. Anything else? Uh... Uh, well, I will ready it action with uh, Preach's All right. We'll come to Brutus. Um, he will not go in like a wrecking ball. He will just keep up with Zach. <laughs> <laughs> Zach? Wow, Brutus isn't being Brutus. Because I'm playing Brutus. Uh, yeah. That's literally the only thing keeping him from military rig of wall down. Yeah, not gonna wall down. <laughs> or attempting to. We're here. Oh, we're good, guys. The brothers oh, yeah, have the same are, eyes. Are fantastic. All right. She's up. All right. Um, I'm gonna ready an action to shoot any hostiles or anyone I perceive to be in ho a hostile. All right. Good luck. Uh, let's just do what I've been doing. Twenty-three. All right. Um, as you concentrate really hard on and listen all around you, from what you can tell. You guys are the only people here so far. <laughs> we'll whisper back to the preach. I think we're the only ones here. Preach is just done. Well. Wow. 
with that, it actually preaches turn. Uh, all right. I guess I'll have him move to stand up and. Just ready to action. All right. Brutus will come over here to these rocks and grunt. Mm. Zach. <laughs> uh, oh, fuck. What's going on, guys? <clears throat> Just my action to eat up. Boop, boop. All right. Is that it? Is that it? Yeah, that's it, he said. Jesus? Uh, I'm going to keep, you know, readying actions. Oh, okay. You're on the Overwatch. Yep. Could I just say that and, you know, you know to skip me? <laughs> yep, I can. Okay. Um, on your turn, though, for being on Overwatch, you are free to roll perceptions. Oh, may I roll perception then? Yes, you may. Right. All right. Yeah. Um, as you look around um, and your experience in the wasteland, uh, being a you know, raid or sniper and all that, you are just getting more and more indicators that this place is not occupied by anyone. The only indicators that this place has any activity at all going on is the fires. Okay. Is it possible to also check behind us? Yes, you can. Okay. In that case, I'd like to check behind Wait, us. One second. Was at the door? So, Shiza, you may check behind the group. Okay, do you want me to roll another twist perception? Twist it left and twist it right. Yeah, yeah roll another one. Yeah, All right, yeah. uh, as you check behind you, you do not notice anything out of the ordinary. Okay, uh, I'm going to keep my head on the swivel then. I'm in Overwatch. All right. Budloff. All right. Yep, we're still dandy. You guys are okay, okay. All right, reach. All right. Anything else? Bam. Oh, oh there it is. Well, too bad you don't have advantage. Um, as you look inside, you see that the fires that were lit by the spellcasters and had gone out a long time ago have actually been relit. Anything else, Preach? Uh, just keeping my ready to action. 
All right. Brutus will come over here to look to preach and walk through the door. <laughs> Shield in front of him. Yep, and let's walk straight in like he owns the place. Oh, okay. He's a bear. Zach. <clears throat> I'm going to... All right. Um, as you perceive inside, you notice signs that another group, um, probably up by the altar area where they could focus their camp, had used this place recently to make camp. Um, other than that, in the fires, that is the only sign this place has been visited by anything sentient in a very long time. Very well. Uh, all right. Tiza? Um, okay. I made an Overwatch macro. Very well. Um, <laughs> so as you check the over the cathedral again, pretty much the same thing as before. And then as you check the rear, you notice uh, some movement behind you. Roll me a quick knowledge nature check. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you pretty much attribute that to the standard wasteland. Uh, flora and fauna type stuff. You know, things out, you know, things that come out at night when it's cooler or out hunting, stuff like that. Yeah, but, you know, I'm going to probably check behind us first now. Mm. All right. Well, yeah. Odla? Oh, boy. Instead of doing anything else, I'm just going to boop, boop, not right in front of the doorway. All right. My turn. Yes, it is. So. Proceed and then Perception. God fucking it's gonna be that kind of Yes. Oh dear. Well, with the six Um just like you were told, this is a nice cathedral. It's See a really rock? nice uh that's a, that's a nice rock. <laughs> really nice stained glass window over the altar in the back. You know, that kind of deal was pretty much it. All right. That Brutus will move up deeper in the room, and he'll look around. Well, his perception, he looks around, um, he looks back to the group and gives you guys a very hairy thumbs up. Pretty much indicating it's clear up to him. Thanks, bud. Thanks, bud. Thanks, big guy. And when all when all goes wrong, you lied to me. <laughs> all right, Zach. Ah, uh, fuck, man. Hi. Myself close to the walls here. Um, pretty much kind of like Brutus. You're able to tell is like you don't hear anything or um see anything. Same old. Go ahead. Pretty much just the same thing as last time. Yep. 
Um, okay. So if there's anybody here waiting to ambush you guys, they are like really good at hiding. <laughs> All right. Okay. She's up. Uh, did you read what I just posted? Yes, I did. I even responded. I didn't see you respond. Uh, that's because I don't talk to myself. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes, you may. Okay, so I guess Overwatch first. And survival if I still see movement? Um, you do still see movement behind you. Um, pretty much, you know, it's like coyotes and stuff like that out hunting. Okay, so, gotcha. Alright, that's my turn. Alright. Staying on Overwatch. Good luck. No, oh, I don't smell shit. No. No, you do not. You smell fires, that's about it. <laughs> Preach might need a bath. Brutus definitely needs a bath. That's pretty much it. Alright, I'm just gonna walk on in deeper. Alright. Preach. Can't hear you, bud. Alrighty, doing my bounding cover. Alright. Vaulty. Cover. Vaulty. Holding my action. Hardcore parkour up. Yeah. All right. <sighs> I'm so fucking sick of this already. <laughs> so fucking. Be, be one of those nights. <laughs> Please, Lord, let all the bad rolls be getting out right yeah, now. Yeah, let them be flushing. Swear to God. I swear to God, if combat comes up, I will leave. All right. Um, Brutus look, is going to look around the area, and he's going to look back to Zach and, you know, make his usual grunting sounds and stuff, pretty much communicating to Zach, like, where the fuck are the people we're supposed to be here to meet? Zach's just going to shrug and be like, dude, good fucking question. All right. And about that time, hunters <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> no. All right, Zach, it's your turn. Uh, I guess I'm going to fucking move my... Fuck, I don't even know where I want to go from here. You know what? We're good. Yeah, they're fucking Not this place at all. Fucking golden pony. And that's it. All right. She's a. The entire party has entered the building. <laughs> all right. Very well. Um, pretty much the same stuff you've been noticing before, as you check forward, you see the entire party has entered the building, and you are alone and unafraid outside. <laughs> All right. Be very, be very I am actually very nervous. <laughs> Good, you should be. Welcome to being a sniper. Uh, I think I'm going to take one else. I'm going to try this. Great. Boom. Insight. Um, with a 15 insight, um, and your guess. Yeah, I'm guessing. Probably, in your guess and your intuition, knowing that you're probably here to meet um, whoever you're supposed to give this stuff to, you're probably very early. Oh. Okay, I'm still going to hold an action in case something tries to come through this door. All right. Z, when I look up in this cathedral, what do I see? Is there a roof on it? Is it collapsed? What's up? Um, there's holes in the roof. Um, it's not fully collapsed. Um, pretty much a lot of the structure that still remains of the roof is 
on the support beams. So a lot of the suspended part is what's falling in. Um, as you look up, all right. I'm going to fly up into the support beams. <laughs> all right, you may do so. And I'm going to... Uh... Are they running from side to side, or uh, are they running from east to west or north to south? Um, east to west. Think Gothic Cathedral. Okay, so, all right. Side to side. Yep. Uh, and then, since this... Okay, I have this one. Uh, I'm just going to be moving across the support uh, rack. All right. How far apart are they? Uh, there's about 30 feet between each one. 30 feet between each one? There's not that many. It's a small cathedral. Alright, so I'm going to go over here to... Above Brutus? Yeah, above Brutus. Alright, um, Brutus... Perception. Alright. God fucking Solid. damn it. <laughs> Inspirational. Alright. Uh, Brutus will basically go up here to kind of like where the altar steps are, and he's going to sit down and huff and look like he's waiting for whoever's supposed to show up so he can kill them because he's a bear to show up. And with that, Zach. Uh. Fuck. I guess I'll set myself up basically right here. And watch out for anything coming this way. All right. She's a. I do that. <laughs> All right. You pretty You're much. You're trying to get me to move. You're gonna have to shoot at me. All right. And you shall <laughs> receive. Pretty much the same stuff you're going to see as before. Gotcha. Out of curiosity, is this how it's going to be for the next while? Yes. yes. All right. Except for my ready to action is now with the 1903 with Shredder. All right. Well, uh, as you guys kind of sit here holding your positions, uh, 15 minutes go by and nothing has yet happened. Uh, mind if I roll Overwatch again? Sure. Same stuff as before. One other thing I'm looking for now. Is there a better nest? I mean, other than the top of another rock, not really. Like, there's no place within, I don't know, uh, 1,200 meters? I mean, there's locations around you that would be better. However, with the entire group inside of the building you would only be able to support them as long as the hostiles remain outside. If they sh uh, show up. In that case, I think I'm actually going to go head inside and try to climb onto the roof and okay. use that as my my roost or nest, however you want to be. All right. Um, you can go ahead and position yourself in the building where you choose. Do I need to roll anything to get... Um... To the roof? Yeah, but I mean, you're gonna have to roll athletics to get up there. Okay, well, I pretty much want to be over the door frame, <laughs> but you know, without a silhouette. Uh, all right, so, roll me stealth. Stealth first? Uh, athletics, then. Uh, roll me athletics too. All right. Uh, it takes you a pretty long time, but yes, you are able to get up there. Sweet. And I keep the 24, right? Yep, you will keep the 23. 23. My bad. All right. So it's been about 30 minutes, and you guy, uh, Preach, roll me a quick perception check. Fucking, oh my god, dude. 
Throw me another one. There we go. All right. Um, so as you're looking around and from your knowledge of stuff with the bell slingers and stuff, the altar, um, it looks disturbed to you. Um, you know, the spell slingers were very OCD about where they placed things on their altars, and this one's messed up. Uh, so I'm going to fly down over to the altar, mm -hmm. and I'm going to check it out. I'm going to investigate it. All right, roll me an investigation. Oh, wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. A fucking skill that I am not proficient with, and I roll a fucking nat. All right. So as you investigate <laughs> the altar, some of the goblets and stuff are out of order and all of that <coughs> stuff. Um, as you do, everyone else can roll me perceptions. Just the one? Just the one. All right. I'm going to go pee real quick. All right. I got you, bud. Hopefully All I have right. the advantage button. And I'm going to roll one for Brutus. All right. So, Odloff and Zach and yes. Preach, you will hear this. You hear... Um, well, for three of you, this sound would be familiar. Okay. Um, for Shiza, probably not. But you guys recognize the sound of an airship. Oh, fucking hail. Um, and Shiza, as you look up, you see airship. well, airships. You see pretty much these airship type things. Um, and coming off of them are ropes, and there are some figures rappelling to the ground. I'm hoping to not have been spotted. But... <laughs> or, you know, you could shoot them as they're coming down the rope. I don't know what the airships are. Fuck. I don't know that these are most likely hostiles. All right. But, um... I mean, the moment that I do know, I can shoot, right? Yes, you may. Okay. The airships um... are back, bud. Okay. Um, also... Zach and Olaf, roll me quick perception checks. Me and you got to do another perception check. Actually, not Olaf. Sorry, you're not in the right spot. Uh, okay. Zach, roll me a perception. Oh, well, you don't see it, um, but until it's too late, you see a small black disc land right in front of you. Um, you think it's a grenade. Uh, you said it's over this way? It's like right in front of you. Well, I'm just going to uh, put myself behind that wall. All right. As you do, you hear a small whine and then a, the sound of something popping into life. And this wow. happens all around you guys. Oh, uh, fucking uh, hell. Damn it. All right. And then you guys hear this. Um, you guys can hear people entering the church. And I got to make sure I select the right people. These guys show up. Oh, hi, guys. Um, from the front area, this is specifically for Shiza, um, you oh, see God. coming down a, these guys basically enter into the building. Um, Shiza, you see as these guys enter the building and stuff, they're not hostile to you guys at all. Um, in fact, Olaf, as the one guy takes his position next to you, you recognize the Bratva symbol on his armor. Oh, shit. Oh, um, all going to be like, hello, brother, and Ruthenian. Um, the man will look at you, and he will say, he will say, Dobre vice, brata. English, please. He said hello, brother. Oh, look, okay. He said okay. good evening, brother. Okay. Co um, and she's, uh, as so my phone they too, have under, come under past you, you see a man walking with a cat folk woman. Um... She is beside him, and her hands are bound. And he is walking up into the church. 
Now I'm imagining everyone would look to the front door and you guys will see Jonathan Graves. He is walking in holding Limu. Oh, Olaf's going to just go uh, all hair. Can I, I know exactly what I want to do. All right. I'm keeping my rifle trained on him, though. Onto my watch. Graves not dead. Send word to Thaddeth. All right. So your watch manages to push the message out. Is that it? I'm going to send the coordinates as well. Oh, okay. So he's going to walk in, and he's got Limu, and she looks very, very confused. Um, and Jonathan is going to look at Olaf, and he's going to say, Tell your group not to try anything. The cat folk dies. Don't try anything. Yeah, Olaf's just going to look and be like, Do not try anything. Um, all right. He, I don't have a token for him. Yeah. It's irrelevant. Yeah. Uh, I think I can pull um, out for him. Anyway, he's actually going to walk up by the altar. And he's going to look to preach and be like, don't worry, the buyer is coming soon. Buyer for what? He's going to point to Olaf, the password for the Evergrad vault that Olaf so helpfully brought to us. Can I hear that? Yep. Olaf's going to be like, well, that's what's on the deal. Mm -hmm. Oh. Who no. are you selling this to? He's just saying it's kind of more like to himself. You'll meet. I'm sure you'll rec remember the buyer soon enough. Um, as he says that, from underneath where the altar is, there is a sudden massive pulse of energy. And preach, you feel very sick. Everyone else is fine. You feel able, you feel just absolutely ill. Like you ate gas station sushi ill. Ugh. You don't uh, have to God. make con. I was going to do it to not puke. Oh. <laughs> uh, with the 12, you managed to hold your dinner in. But I'm going uh, to grab the side of the altar. Ugh. And with that, Jonathan will uh, look to the altar and be like, so, Gracchus managed to find the artifact after all. Gonna look up at uh, Graves and uh, be like, he's the fucking buyer, isn't he? Now you're putting it together, Oberhauser. Yes, Gracchus is buying the key to the Evergrad vault in exchange for helping me take control of the Bratva. Quick question. Yes. Am I close enough to have heard pretty much everything that's been going on in the church? Yes. Yes, you do. Okay. Uh... Preach is going to look at this man and look him in the eye and be like, you're not going to leave me alive. Jonathan's going to kind of chuckle. I believe it will be all of you who will not leave here alive. Quite unfortunate, Olaf showed promise for a dumb dog. And then yeah, he's... I forgot Olaf was a yog too. Yeah. How could you forget his picture right there? <laughs> he does his picture doesn't look like a yogger. Uh, fair enough. Okay. Um <laughs> Brutus is fuming. He looks like he's about to beat the shit out of this guy. Oh, he's not the only one. Um so, is anyone gonna try anything? Uh, no. I'm actually gonna switch my Overwatch thing to when given a given the word or you know a signal instead of you know when they turn hostile. Can I light up a cigarette? All right. Um. 
Olaf's going to look at Lemu and just, just like not even looking at fucking um, Jonathan at this point and ask her. He's going to be like, are you harmed? Lemu's just like, I, I think I'm okay. I just, I've never, I've never been in this kind of situation before. And you will not again, I promise on my word. All right. So, as you guys basically are at a Mexican standoff for a while, um, after a bit of time, the altar next to you, Preach, will actually shift. Okay. Um, and as it shifts back, a staircase will essentially appear, and out will come... Look at these guys. The dark lord. Yeah, the dark, the dark lord of the Sith. Dum, 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 dum. Come. Now I gotta get the rest of these guys selected too. Oh, the hunters guys came into into the building. Um, Brutus recognizes one of these hunters as the one that bested him. Mm. And Gracchus, as he walks by, will look to preach, and he's gonna chuckle. I suppose I have you to thank for my recent successes, Oberhauser. Preach isn't gonna say. Um. Uh, as you guys see them come up, he has one of his hunters carrying a very ornate chest. Um, as it passes by you, Preach, you don't get a con save. You okay. throw up. This makes you feel so absolutely ill. And if and as you look at it, it is brighter than the sun. It's Yo, dude, is that like the is that like the Ark of the Convenient? <laughs> nope. Nope. <laughs> Don't worry, when you guys figure out the name, you'll actually be really pissed at me. Oh, it's that fucking thing that we had in the beginning. No, inside the chest is the mask of Mary Van. Ah, oh, you fucking bitch. <laughs> you asshole. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> fucking hate you. <laughs> wow, right. okay. <laughs> and yes, that kid is the Ark of the Convenient. Did you like that? I did, that was really... I'm glad that was caught on tape. Oh, it's caught. I, <laughs> that that, that is always going to be forever oh, on broadcast. <laughs> yeah, I know, but whatever. What now? Uh, I wouldn't know what is in the chest, would I? No, you would not. I'm just telling you guys that, so you know what is coming, essentially. It also fits really well. Anyway. <laughs> Um, so Gracchus will walk forward, and he will look to Odloth, and he will hold out a metallic gloved hand, and he will, he will tell Odloth, The files, if you please, young sir. Odloth's gonna look at him and be like, I don't have them on me. My brother does. Gracchus will look to Zach. The same request, young Kamel. As far as I'm walking, he can meet me halfway. Uh, he will meet you halfway. Um, as he does, this is a massive man. Brutus is bigger, but only just. Oh, wow. Um, anyway, so he will take the file. Did you give him both files or just the one? Just the one. Uh, he will pocket that and he'll kind of chuckle. I said the files. I know you made the copy. You were muted, bud. You didn't come in on that one. Oh. Now, well, can. Give me one now I can. Now I can. Now I can. Yep. What about now? Yep. Z, if you remember, I had the copy. Oldloff gave the original to Thadith. Yeah. Oh, my bad. Yeah. No, you're good. There's a while, that was a while ago. Anyway, yeah, yeah. He will take the copy and he will put it in one of the pockets on his armor and he will sign and be like, that. Was easier than expected. Gonna look back to preach. 
I figured you'd have more of a spine after all of this time, Oberhauser, but I guess I shouldn't be too surprised. It was always made of weak bone for you. And then he's uh, going... Oh, oh, feel free? Nope, nope, go ahead. No, you can say whatever you were going to say. Uh, Preach is going to look at him like only the weak prey upon the dead. Oh, uh, uh, he's just going to kind of chuckle. Only the weak will not use all of the power they have. But I am a busy man, and unfortunately this abomination of a creation needs its sustenance. And he's going to walk over to Limu, and he's going to kind of put a hand on her shoulder and be like, I'm sorry, my dear. The mask is hungry. And I need everyone to roll me a charisma save. Great. About to Yay. take a new feat called fucking bloodlust. Uh, yep, charisma. Charisma save. All right, I'll roll one for Brutus. Knowing Brutus, he's probably not going to pass. Oh, wow. He did not pass this. It's unfortunate. You guys all take five psychic damage as you watch Gracchus pull Limu's soul from her body and feed it into the chest. The psychic damage is from witnessing an event that is basically, I described it as, pure should not be. And Limu's corpse falls to the ground. Damn. Well, that was fun. That being said, can I shoot him now? Yes, you may. All right. Do not forget that I am right in front of him. <laughs> uh, it's okay, me... I have two aim actions, and I'm prone. I need to roll initiative then for everybody. Go ahead and clear the list. Does a 32 uh -huh. hit? Or a 31 hit? It will. Just let me get everyone's initiative in. Okay. <laughs> now we're beginning. Still chuckling about that. The arc of the convenience. <laughs> I mean, it's not like he would know what it's actually called. It's the apocalypse. The, yeah. great, the great thing is, is on the... Uh... The description of this, and I'm going to be featuring the magical item, the art of the convenience. It, it really kind of was. It, but that was great. I had to think of something that the spell slingers would not want anyone to ever get access to. And since they use their magic for a lot of stuff, I felt like an artifact that got rid of their magic abilities would be kind of something you're like, yeah, this could never get out. Yeah. All right. So... Oh, hey, Co. good news. What? You're keeping the car while I'm deployed. Oh, what happened? What changed? Uh, I convinced my mother that it's a good idea, and she knows that I'm a good judge of character. Oh, well, tell your mother I said thank you. All right. So she's a, yes, a 31 will hit. Hopefully I'm able to get the sneak attack. Uh, you are. And with that, um, the round will kind of like hang into Gracchus's armor and he'll look up at the rafters. And. Hopefully he doesn't see me. Oh no, he saw you. <laughs> oh fuck. Yeah. You done, he, bitch. <laughs> he is going to use one of his legendary actions. Oh boy. Uh, uh, You're right. fucked. I need a charisma save. From Chisa. Christmas save? Yep. Oh, oh shit. Oh, oh, right. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, lovely. that's a zero nat failure. <laughs> a zero nat failure. All right. Oh, bite me. <laughs> that's impressive. I've never seen it happen. Never seen a zero on the die. <laughs> All right. That's because it's a one. <laughs> you take 20 psychic damage. Holy oh. shit. Ooh. And you drop your... Well, you're already prone, aren't you? Yeah. 
So you're going to, you essentially shrivel up into the fetal position as you are forced to relive the nightmare of the day your child was taken from you by Gracchus. Oh, in that case, she's just screaming her fucking lungs out. <laughs> I can only imagine. Yeah. All right. As that happens, <laughs> let me check something. All right. Yep. We'll still be able to have this happen. All right. This guy in the back. This guy in the back is basically going to raise his weapon, and he's looking at the Rafa guys, and he gives a nod, and that's his turn. Then the next guy, the next guy from the Bratva, um, he turns his weapon, and he shoots Jonathan straight in the chest. Oh, shit. Oh, damn. As Jonathan's laying there, he looks up at Gracchus, and he's like, we had a deal. And Gracchus is going to chuckle, and he's like, you have no power over me. And he's going to curb stomp his skull in. Oh, Jesus. Serves you right, Peckerwood. Yep. Now it's about to get real. Yeah, it is. All right. This guy is going to, this guy here in the corner, he's going to turn to preach. Um, and he's going to come over here. And he's going to swing with his hatchet. Wow. What? So we found the fucking pettit of this group. <laughs> if it's. I've got a 16 to my AC. Oh, he didn't hit you. No, you get it. You got a reaction. He rolled in that one. Oh, okay. So he he didn't hit, or did he hit? No, he missed. He rolled like a. Oh, then I'm coming back with my fucking hatchet. All right, roll it. Yeah, you hit. Roll damage. Deal nine slashing damage to him. All right, next guy's turn. This next guy is going to displace positions. He's going to turn around. He's going to shoot Brutus. He's going to hit Brutus for five. Maybe. There we go. Thank you, Rolf. Wonderful program. All right, the guy next to Brutus will move away. Bruce will take his attack of opportunity. Give him the cleaver. He's giving him the bang stick. I don't know why oh, he yeah. doesn't need that thing I more. forgot about that damn bang stick. Alright, he takes 33 damage. Fucking bitch, what? dude. Oh. Uh, so and he is gonna have to roll for injury from that. Okay. Wow. Only in 25, eh? Oh, bruised rib. So he's a little winded. Odloff. Okay. I'm assuming if I leave this little area, I'm going to get an attack opportunity against me. Possibly. Yeah. You know what? I'm going to turn and where's it at? Where's it at? All right. The dude right beside me. Very well. Stand by. Does it hit? Um, it will hit the wall next to him as he counters by swinging out with his own hatchet, knocking the shotgun right out of the way. Okay. Still get another action on your turn. All right. Does it hit? Let me check. Yep, that one hits. Okay. All right. 
pull that up. Okay. The only reason he's still up is the DR he had from his body armor. But he's rolling for a hefty injury. 76. He now has a moderate concussion. I would have a moderate concussion from that too. Um, yeah, that's fair. Stop point. All right. Where is this guy? Uh, this oh, dude is going to is going to turn to shoot Preach, but he will stop as Gracchus says, no, the spell slinger is mine. And he will nod, and he's going to come down here and swing his hatchet at Zach. Coming at you, Zach. Uh, you can I counter by kicking him in the balls? <laughs> you may roll an unarmed strike. <laughs> Oh. You do not do that. <laughs> and he hits you for 11 slashing. Alright. So this guy... Um... He will turn, and he will shoot that hunter that got fucked up. I can't remember who shot him. But he, oh, that was from the bang stick. He's going to shoot the guy that got bang stick. Oh, well, there's only one Bratva guy that's not against us. Uh, kind oh, of. There's, there's one that is against us, what I meant, because of him shooting John. That would be an accurate description. Very well. All right, he gets one, two, three, four, five, six hits with his PPSH-41. Six, nine, eleven. All right, and this guy has no more DR. And he is down a lot of all right, the guy that's right by him will also turn and shoot that guy. Um, yeah, he's dead. Preach. Uh, so, Gracchus has given the order that they're not to touch me. That it's just me and him? Yep. Very well. Uh, and stimming is a bonus action. Uh, yeah. You recover 23 HP. <clears throat> and then I'm... So if I walk past this guy, I'm free to walk past him, right? Yes. Well, I'm going to shove him to the side. And I'm going to come face to face with Gracchus. All right. And, uh... Risk it for the biscuit. All right. Well, I need you to roll me a con save. Fucking bitch. The spell does not go off. Great fucking job. All right. Ah, uh, Gra Gracchus is going to kind of chuckle. Don't you know what this evil artifact does? I'm not even going to answer him. <laughs> <laughs> A 16 will not hit. 
Can you just go ahead and break my fucking back then? <laughs> uh, no. <laughs> well, that's it. Well, all I got. All right, it is Gracchus's turn. Um, and he's gonna look to preach. I will be with you in a moment, Oberhauser. We have an interloper, and he's gonna turn around and he's going to straight front kick Zach. Um, did I? Can I roll to like go right here? Yes, you may. That's uh athletics, correct? Yes, it is. Um, you managed to get out of the way of his boot. And he's just gonna kinda be like tricky cat. And then he is going to swing at you with his sword. Me? No, Zach. Uh. Well, I already used my reaction. All right. You take eight damage. That's his turn. Uh, this guy down here. Yeah. Where is he? Oh, right he's the guy next to, to Odloff. He's going to look up at Odloff, and he's just going to go, Why, brother? Before bleeding out. Okay. Um, and now it's the sex guy's turn. He will, you'll hear him order the others in Ruthenian, so if you speak Ruthenian, you'll recognize this. He will say, the traitor is dead, our job is done. And he will exit the building. Whoa. What? The, the Bratva, damn it. Could I use a free action to shout at them? Yes, you may. I just want to tell them in Ruthenian that it knows their treachery. Stay and fight if you want some type of forgiveness. Um, they're just going to kind of look at you. And one of them will say, who do you think sent us? Wow. wow. Well, I know a bitch is going to die when I get back. <laughs> All right. I actually see the guy. Uh <laughs> Oh, he's one of the guys that's not supposed to touch Preach. So he will come down here. He will pull his weapon up, and he's going to shoot Udloff. Yep. Wow. Not only did he miss, he jammed. Good job, bud. He jammed an M1 Grand. That guy's a fucking loser. All right. Brutus will come down here. Um, and he's going to take a swing at Gracchus. And he hits for 15 damage. Um, to which Gracchus is just going to basically look at Brutus. So rude. Zach? <laughs> Who are you failure to stopping? Good luck with that. <laughs> yeah, you know what? But if he doesn't pass the fort save, he gets killed outright. All right. I forgot to add that one. Oh, my God. Well, I hate to tell you this. You're not going to kill a boss that easily. He needs to use one of his reactions. Why can't I click this? All right. So as you bring your weapon up to shoot him, he holds out of his hand. He holds out his hand um, and you can basically 
hear like screaming and stuff like that, like you'd expect to hear from some other horrific dimension. And that's basically where your rounds go. Well, that's his reaction, so I'm going to try it again. All right. I could barely stop two. Nope. <laughs> Does not hit. Does not hit. She's up. Am I still screaming and in pain? And... No, it's a one round deal. Okay. Uh, do I take injuries from psychic damage? No. No? Okay, good. Um, in that case, I guess it would be a bonus action if I wanted to switch ammo, right? It would be, yep, because yeah. it is a bonus action. Well, I'm switching to a mag with uh, the boss killer ammo in it, taking one action to aim at Gracchus, and I'm firing. All right. I took one action. Forty. <laughs> yeah, that that hits. <laughs> All right. Military suppressor. Boss killer ammo. Twenty one. Right. You don't get sneak attack, but you do get the other damage. Yeah, I figured because I didn't try to steal. All right. This guy. He will come down here. And he sees you up in the rafters. There, Elsa. Yeah, I figured. Um, and he will shoot you. You have a plus nine for being prone, if I remember correctly. Yeah, but don't I have like? Wouldn't I have like three quarters since I'm in the rafters and he's? Yeah, that's not... what I'm saying. You have a plus nine. Okay. Yeah, you, you have three quarters because you're prone in the rafters. Gotcha. Um, so he will actually miss you. Yay. All right. This guy will then exit the building. Got to find another guy who left. Now find one turn. All right. Where is this dude at? He's back here. He's going to come down over here. He's going to shoot Odlaf. Okay. Um, 26 hits you, I'm assuming? It does. You take 8 ballistic. Uh, let me find my DR. I take how much? 8. Okay, so I take three. All right. That guy right in front of that guy, he will shoot Odlaf. Okay. I'm getting a lot of love. Oh, I'm getting a lot of love. They're about to get a lot of love back. Um, that one actually missed. This one will hit. Uh, you take an additional seven ballistic. Two. Um, that guy was killed by the Bratva Odlaf. Yeah. So. All right. Who are you shooting? The one right here. All right, roll damage. Okay. Did you wait? Did you put in that as a minus five? Uh. -huh. No, you didn't, did you? What? Fair stop two full round action roll one attack at a minus five. Oh, okay. So you actually missed. Okay. All right, this guy, South Brutus, he is going to hatch at Brutus. Hits, eight slashing. Uh, 
Curtis's reaction will be to shield bash him. Hits. 15. Forgot how broken Brutus's shit was. <laughs> um, and this guy will also get knocked back 10 meters. What about the squad online? This guy. <laughs> take his turn leaving. <laughs> this guy will take his turn leaving the building as well. All right. Preach. Uh, uh, Gracchus is going to get uh, Hammered Pair. Very well. Oh, dear. All right. So the first one will miss, and then the second two will hit. All right. That's a hefty damage load. Do you want me to re-roll for that crit? Yeah, roll another one for the crit you critted. All right. Oh, shit. Just, um, uh, it's just 21, 18, and 14. I forgot to take out the secondary damage. You're good. I, I saw that. I checked it because I was like, I don't think he's using a anti-tank rifle. <laughs> All right, where's his last guy? Um, this and, last. Oh, and oh, sorry. Oh, yeah, he's getting a hammer pair. Remember? Oh yeah, my bad. Go ahead. Uh... Those miss, unfortunately. Uh, and then I'm gonna hammer pair again because I'm not moving. All right. Oh, nice. Um, so you get three damage rolls from that one. All right. Oh, it is, bud. The last hand pair. Well, you got three more damage rolls. Uh, no, I'm in from the first. Two. Oh, good. Okay. All right. Okay. Now will be this guy's turn. Get on here. He's gonna look up and see what you did, Odloff. Yeah, I already know. And he's gonna shake his head and, and just basically walk out of the building. Now it's Gracchus' turn. Uh Gracchus will turn to Brutus. Um and he will, will attack him. He will essentially hold out his hand, um, and you, Co, recognize the drain of like necromantic magic pull from Brutus as Brutus takes damage, and Gracchus is, Gracchus is healed from it. Fucking bitch. And he's going to keep draining Brutus. Alright. I don't know what you're saying fucking bitch for. If you keep rolling crits, though. Yeah, but still. Like, he's able to use magic and I'm not. There's a reason. Because he's only using necromancy. Bingo. Yeah. Alright, and then... If he, want, if he wants to play that, we can fucking play that. And then he's going to turn to you, uh, Preach, and use a legendary action. Uh, reaction. Um, I will give you a reaction against this in the form of advantage in a reroll on the save. Okay, what is, all right, what am I rolling? Um, I need you to roll me charisma saving throw. All right, you did it pass. You may re-roll as your reaction. Fucking bitch, dude. All right, whatever. Okay, you will take... Oh, man, that's a lot of math. You will take nine psychic damage. 
Okay. Um, and much like Shiza, you are reliving a horrific moment from your life, and you are now kind of life. Okay, yeah, you were pretty much in your life flash before your eyes again. My whole life. (laughs) Yeah, that. All right. So, like, my next turn, I can't do shit. Uh, your next turn, I will let you roll the charisma saving throw to. Uh, no, it's only for this turn. It'll end after this round. Okay. Um, that guy's dead. Someone betrayed their brothers. These guys left. All right, this guy with the jammed gun. They they came out and then Jonathan showed up. Yep. Uh, This guy. He's got a jammed gun, but he doesn't feel too bad about that. He's going to come right over here and hatch it. Reaction over. Play that game, Odloff. Uh, I'll hatch it him. All right, roll your counterattack. Your counterattack fails to prevent. Okay. Uh, you take 14 slashing. All right. Brutus is looking kind of worse for wear. Um, but he's going to slowly kind of stand to his feet, and uh, he's got the eye of the bear. He looks very pissed off. Uh, he's going to spin up the military rig, and he is going to shield bash Gracchus as hard as he can. Oh, athletic rig. My bad. Got to find him. All right. He's going to spin that up, and he's going to smash Gracchus with his shield, putting both hands into it. Hits Gracchus for 15 damage. Nice. Um, hang on. And... He sends Gracchus 15 meters that way, landing on his back. Nice. All right, Zach. Who is Flammenwerfen? The Flammenwerfer. The cone works, but I was figuring if I could get it down this line, I could get all three of these assholes. All right, give me a second. Dropping a flame cone. Okay. Okay. (laughs) I hate when you're trying to alt something and your screen just, like, glitchy, glitchy. Oh, Jesus. Okay. All right. (laughs) <laughs> um, and make sure the cone length is correct yep okay yep you can hit all those guys for fire damage Olaf barely is out of it yeah no yeah. Uh, <laughs> they take three incendiary damage are they lit on fire they have to make reflex saves to prevent that um uh, or de- uh, deck saves. So that guy's not lit. Oh, that guy's not lit. We get it. The hunters have a high dexterity. Fuck off. <laughs> no, they actually could have failed that. Oh. Uh, he just rolled really low. Basically, the DC for them not catching on fire is the attack roll because it auto hits in the cup. Oh, yeah. She's a. This is, these are gone now. I was muted. Yes, you are? Yeah, so I'm going to use my bonus action to just to switch over to the Shredder rounds. Okay. And which one was the one that shot at me? This one, I think. That one? Um, okay, yeah, action to aim, and I'm going to shoot him. All right. Wow, too bad you didn't have advantage. Uh, Roll damage. Alright. 
The guy to his left's turn. He is going to raise his weapon. Um, she needs to roll me a quick perception check because you're aiming in that direction. Okay. They're more than 25, right? Uh, yep. So, 21? Yeah, you see him just trying to bring up grenade launcher knowing your two choices are jump or eat this. I have a third choice. Which is? Bubble shield. Oh, bubble shield away then. Uh, yeah, can I use that as my reaction? <laughs> yes, you may. Sweet. All right. Uh, let's see, it's under weapons. No. Oh, uh, Z, by the way, uh, my bestow curse thing would have worked then. Oh, is it necromancy? Yeah. Mobby. He would have had to make a wisdom throw, a wisdom saving throw. I will actually do that real quick. I did not know that Preach had any necromancy spells. Yeah, he just, again, it was an oath to not use them. Fair enough. What's the DC on that? Uh, it's going to be a 14. All right, you passed. With a 15. <coughs> wow. <laughs> okay. That guy fired. Uh, seeing the bubble shield, which I have to make the proper size for you, real quick. Okay. Um, did you also put it behind my token? Oh, bubble shield. Sweet. All uh, right. Seeing the bubble shield, though, he will. Can't do anything extra. He'll just want some shot. Get extra damage on it. Hits. Got a bubble shield at very low AC. Bubble shield has taken so far 28 damage. And how much can they take? 100. 100. Okay. All right. Next guy. Um, he's going to move out of the flamethrower. He doesn't like that. Roll me a damage die real quick. Well, I mean, I wouldn't like getting set on fucking fire either. <laughs> yeah. Roll me a damage die real quick, uh, Zachary. Or just roll a damage for the flamethrower. Yeah, give me one sec. Takes nine more incendiary damage. Um, so he's going to step out, and then he's going to shoot Zach. <clears throat> that wasn't very nice. Twenty-five, I assume, hits you. Thirteen ballistic, Zach. Don't forget your DR. That yeah. Do not forget the DR. There we go. All right. Other guy's turn. Go ahead and throw me another damage die real quick. Flamethrower. <laughs> Alright, you take three incendiary. And then he will shoot Odloff. And miss, because he sucks. Is that the pet it? Uh, yeah, probably. Hold off. All right, the guy in front of you, I assume? Yes, sir. All right. Oh, wow. Okay, that hits. Yep. Hold that up for me. Will do. Jesus, fuck. Yeah, that ZK6 with a Sabbath slug is nasty. 73. See if this guy manages to survive for the injury roll. Barely. Um, he's also about to have to roll for a real hefty injury. He is currently on the ground screaming. Ooh. Nah, uh, well, next round he'll be dead. He's bleeding out. He severed an artery. Oh, good. 
Nice. And since I yeah, didn't yeah. move, can I do another failure to stop? Yes, you may. Cool. Dude, it just shot me. Alright. That will hit. Seventy two. Well, they weren't expecting you guys to have a gun like that. You got to roll for injury as well. Wow. What he get? Um, he's unconscious. He got a major concussion. Who? Uh, the guy that just shot. <laughs> yeah, one bleeding out, one with a major concussion. He's essentially out of combat now. Um, that being said, it is this guy's turn. He's going to turn to the bubble shield. And, Zach, you recognize the sound of the military rig power up. Mm. God damn it. And that'll all hit the bubble shield. Uh, five, six, seven... Eight, nine. I have to do some math real quick. Well, how's everyone enjoying the session so far while I do this math? Oh, I'm loving it. <laughs> Except for Lemo dying. I'm having fun. Yeah. How come I couldn't um, have used my reaction then? Because he did turn a bit hostile. Who? Brackus. Were you expecting him to rip someone's soul out of their body? Well, he did say the thing was hungry and that he was sorry. That doesn't really sound too good, and he's magical. I mean, wasn't expecting it, but she's a doesn't everybody really... was everybody was caught off guard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah fair enough. <laughs> All right. Um, that doesn't apply. You, she's your bubble shield shatters. And preach, it is your turn. Uh. <laughs> So he's prone? Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. Uh, Preach is going to walk over and be like, you want to play the game, Gracchus? We'll play the game. Um, oh, shit. As you do that, he's going to chuckle, and you see him have something in his hand, and there's a little red button on it, and he presses it. Okay. Um, and there's a boom, and I'll just use a polygon line real quick for this. And the ceiling begins to collapse, and that white line is now rubble, blocking you in with Gracchus by yourself. You are alone and unafraid, my friend. All right. Well, I still hit him. With vampiric tip. Vampiric touch. Yes, you did. Ten, and I get that ten. Very well. <laughs> um, Preach said he ain't playing no motherfucking games no more. Uh, yeah, Preach, and then, the, yeah, and uh, crush his throat. I can't. Uh, actually, I'm just gonna bonus action. Wave. All right. Very well. Um. Ah, oh, damn it! Do I have to roll a Constitution to see if that even fucking worked? Yep. You pass. Woohoo! So it can work, but the cost is wow. Um, you ready to hear this hefty, hefty cost there, bud? Fucking what? One damage. <laughs> <laughs> One damage. Very well. All right. Um, something else I was going to do. Uh, well, it's Gracchus' turn. Gracchus. And he's going to kind of stand up and chuckle. He's going to look at you, preach, and he's be like, I didn't expect you would fall that far. 
I wonder what would break first. And now we can have some fun. Do, 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 do. All right. So he's going to come right up here in your face. Uh -huh. Oof. You take. <laughs> Nothing. You need it, but roll me a con save actually first. That's oh, you make it. <laughs> All right, you still take five damage for trying to use a spell. There's a lot of sass in that church. Oberhauser. All right, that's that guy's turn. This guy is dead. Um, the guy in front of you? Yeah, bleeding out, severe, uh, severed artery. Well, not quite. We could get lucky on the 1d10 bleed. Okay. He does, actually. He... Okay. He only takes one damage. Oh, okay, cool. He's actually still alive. Okay. Uh, what about the fire? That gets rolled on Zach's turn. Yeah. Oh. They, he hasn't moved in. He's still standing in it. Yeah. Um, so he is actually going to... Mm, they're fanatical, so they do this. He's going to go out like a champ. Oh. All right, Olaf. Reaction? Um, you can react against this. Okay. Um, he brings his weapon up at point-blank range, and you see him squeezing the trigger on the grenade launcher. I dunk and hit him in the nuts with my hatchet. All right, roll damage. You hit, roll the damage, and roll me a D100. Yeah, I figured this was going to happen, but whatever. If you go out like a champ, I'm going to fight. Yeah, his finger squeezes. It'd go over my head. Uh, I mean, it's still going to land pretty close. Okay, that's fine. I'll take so I'll it. I'll give you half damage of this. Okay. You take 20 explosive. 20 explosive? And that right there is my first injury. That uh, is definitely an injury. Yep. So straight D100? Uh, you dropped pretty low. Give it to me plus 20. Okay, so I'm just going to roll a D100 and then plus 20 on top. Yep. So 76. That's uh, a nice. 76. Moderate concussion. Roll 2D8s. 2D8. You are dazed for eight rounds, and then after that, sickened for four rounds. It's going to be a long upward battle. And first eight of moderate concussion if you go look at the injury. Oh, I know. I, I was looking at eight days. Brutus. Uh, Brutus doesn't like that he can no longer help his friend preach. Um, so he's going to back up. And he's going to try to charge the wall. Seems Bruce enough, right? Yeah. Yeah. Where's the shield? Um, he hits the wall pretty hard. In fact, Preach, you see some bricks come flying into the room, and hear uh, you hear Brutus roar. Oh shit! He's trying to breach the room. Yeah. Okay. Sweet. Zach. So I'm just rolling this so I can do the damage for that dude at the bottom. Yep. Okay. And that's not actually that's not actually my turn. That's just so I could get the damage. Yeah, he's dead. Okay. Uh, so first thing I'm gonna do is shoot this asshole twice because I have a burst gun. All right. Those both hit. Roll the damages. Um, are you, is it suppressed or unsuppressed right now? Suppressed. We're not really in a stealthy environment. All right, then he takes. Got it. Mm. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Uh, right. Gonna shoot him again. Another burst. 
if anybody is paying attention to Discord, I have a Spotify soundtrack playlist up that you can probably listen to. All right. I like One it. round hit. <laughs> I'm realizing a, a interesting perk of burst fire guns. You can get a lot of rounds off. Uh, not only that, can you get a lot of rounds off? Um, because you're getting a lot of rounds off, it breaks armor faster. Precisely. She's up. Um. Okay. You're so right which back. one? Which one has a grenade launcher? Um. That's not what I wanted to do. Thank you for pointing. This one. Oh, yeah, it's this one. One in the back. Yep. The other one ran the military rig. Okay. Um... Mm. Which one looks more hurt? Mm, the one with the military rig. All right. I am going to uh, bonus action to pull off. No, it's an action, isn't it, to take a suppressor off? Yep. In that case, never mind. Um, action to... I'm going to take an action to aim and shoot at the guy with the military rig, since he looks worse for wear. All right. Twenty-five. Yeah. Roll the damage. Yep. 23. All right. I am using Shredder ammo, too. Yeah. Now. Okay. All right. Uh, the guy with the grenade launcher's turn. He is going to... Check this thing real quick. Range what 15 meters? Yeah. All right, he's gonna shoot cheese. He's gonna put a fresh 40 mic mic in and he's gonna shoot cheese. Uh, um, I'll give you the same perception as before. Okay, so roll perception mm -hmm. 23 it's beyond 25 meters. They so do see it. Um, you brought up a fresh grenade. You know your options are eat it or jump. I'm making sure I have a good grip on my rifle and rolling off the edge. All right. Roll me an athletics. What the hell? I just clicked it. Oh, okay. 14. All right. Uh, unfortunately, you don't land just as daintily as you needed to. Roll me. 36 a... because it's 30 feet? No. No? Um, roll me. Roll me a D100. All right. That's the closest one. Um, as you fall, there is a solid crunch as you feel your shin bone break. Ow. But you weren't bl blown up. Yeah. Uh, you sure you don't want me to roll fall damage? Mm, yeah, go ahead and roll it. I was going to give you the injury instead of fall damage to keep you around. Wow. Uh, that does give me a second injury, though. Uh, no, you have the injury from falling. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. I don't want you to roll like a, a you know, whatever. Okay. We'll, uh, this guy, he is going to turn, and he's going to shoot. Seeing what Brutus is trying to do, he's going to shoot Brutus. Why did I bring a Brutus to shoot? Um, 
You're getting ready for his reflex. Yeah, I am. <laughs> um, that's not good. Zach, you, you know, these guys have military rigs. You can hear it. Um, this guy brings it up in a stream of fire, just smashes into Brutus. Ah. <laughs> Uh, yeah, Bruce is down. Shit. Uh, I got rolled for his. Well, he's not here, so I'm not going to do an injury for him. Roy, uh, check, uh, check DM. Yeah, I saw that, Co. You degenerate. I would walk into your turn. <laughs> oh, no, I saw it. <laughs> Life has many doors, that boy. Let's see, I'm dazed, so. Mm hmm. You're going to basically have a disadvantage on things involving sight. Yeah. So, I'm going to do a full round action of healing. All right. P popping both of my stem packs and eating a crystal. All right, very well. Those are good stem pack rolls. I know. Where are you getting the plus three from? You don't add your strength to a stem what? pack. What? Okay. I, I didn't even, I just made that, so I didn't even pay attention to it. <laughs> it's, it's a 15. 15, and an eight. and a two. All right. Speaking of stem packs. All right. guy wow okay cool this guy jab himself with a stem pack as an action and then he will shoot zach well to zach how much 12 Ugh. dr don't forget don't forget the dr okay you go ugh sometimes, and I'm like, oh, no. <laughs> so you went down? Okay. DR. <laughs> All right, preach. Why Zach figures out how body armor works. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> My turn? Yes. All right, so he's going to get this. That is a necromancy spell. Yep. Hit. Uh, yep. Nine, and then he's getting double tap. Or, not double tap, but you know what I mean. Mm, Rochambeau. He, <laughs> he's getting fucking hammered pair. Alright. He's going Steven Seagal on his ass. That will miss. You get one hit out of that, but he does get a reaction because this is a point blank. Only one? Yeah, you only got one damage roll. Or one uh, damage. Look at the jam. Aww. Aww. <laughs> Thanks, Thank Elsa. You, she's a... Damn. Fucking bitch, I hope you die. <laughs> I probably will at this rate. Good. Alright. <laughs> Gracchus' reaction now. Uh, this is what I want to do. You take Co. Oh, wow, that was just pathetic. What? I need a charisma save, Co. Do I get the reroll or what? No, you got that as a reaction to his actual attack. This was the reaction he used. All right, you take ten damage, three necrotic, seven psychic. Here's the pathetic thing: the necrotic damage on this attack is three d six. He rolled three ones. Wow, good job, bud. Asked, that was your bestow curse. He now has your dice rolls. Ah. <laughs> All right. It is his turn. He will swing. All right. He's swinging with a melee attack. You do get your reaction if you want to take it, Preach. Uh, I will. Can I parry his uh, melee attack? Yes, you can. With uh, like with my 
attach it? Yes, you can. Um, you don't manage to get the parry. Damn it. All right. Uh, you get hit for... I hate how it's a little talking to yourself thing in the um, bottom. You take 13 slashing and 2 fire. 13 and... I'm pretty sure I'd take a fucking wound. Yeah, I'd definitely take a wound. Uh, only straight injury, D100. All right. Wow. Wow. That's a very low injury. Uh, let's see what horrific... <laughs> you strained your back. There it is, Kel. <laughs> well, you know what they say about back injury. Just the littlest thing will agitate it. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> um, minus five to your actions for the next round, and that's it. <laughs> All right. That's hilarious. All right. The dice knew. <laughs> the dice know. Um. Oh, that guy's dead. Brutus is out until he gets healed. Zach, roll me a perception. Yep. All right, you do not know these guys are coming. Fuck. Oh, I can see him too. Fuck that. Fuck that guy. Actually, I put him on the wrong way. I see him too! Alright. I gotta throw up these guys' initiatives real quick. Reinforcements. The beacons of Gondor were lit. Whoa, wait. How would this guy even be able to get through with that rubble right there? Yeah, I mean, he's here. If you didn't notice, there's a gap down here. Down there? Yeah. Oh, very well. That's what, uh, that's what Olaf had Overwatch on before everything went to hell in a hand basket. Gotcha. Zach, I came in the other way. Uh, fucking Fiddle, bitch. All right, Fiddle him. <laughs> um, both of those will hit. Uh, so it's a six. He has to roll for injury as well. Ah. Uh, uh, so as your rounds hit him, it spins him around. One of your rounds hits him around the shoulder area. And you hear a nice popping noise as his arm hangs limp. Oh, nice. Um, Next thing I'm going to do is... Diddle him. What? Going to diddle him. Uh, yes. With that. All right, roll it. Minus five is a 17. Oh my god, that hits. And 13. He has to pass a fort save of one third of the damage. Have to pull that up real quick. Fort save of 10. Or con save, I bet. Uh, he passes, but only just. Hmm. Still takes. Still takes a good bit of damage. Zach said, fuck your healing turn. Wait, that's, that's not a suppressed weapon right now, is it? Nope. Uh All right, that it, Zach? Uh, uh, healing yet? So that's it. All right, she's a. Uh, well, I guess technically I'm on the ground, right? So. Yeah. Uh, and did I fall prone basically on my ankle? Yeah, you kind of snap? collapsed. Okay. Um, am I able to move with that? You can move at half of your speed. You essentially would be crawling. Okay. I uh, just need to see what the range is for the Hel uh, Helsing. 30? 30. 30 meters. Mm -hmm. Nah. I'll, um... 
you know, take a take an aim action. Yep. And fire at this guy with the SMLE. All right, shoot him. Yep. Prone. Thirty-two will definitely hit. Twenty-two. Uh, Twenty-two. Okay. Uh, sucks to be this guy. What the one that just impacted himself last round? Yeah, because it's just it's all gone now. <laughs> On in that round, found a nice home, right in his chest. And he's kind of wheezing really hard as he falls on the ground. Um, most of his ribs are kind of dust now. Oh, nice. Yeah, you guys break a lot of people's ribs. Yeah. All right. We're the weird, this guy, weird breakers. This guy, who is the one that has the chest with the mask, he is going to get that artifact out of here. This one that. Zach just fucked up last round. Um, I can't remember what injury did he get? Uh, broken arm, broken shoulder. shoulder I think. Oh, he, dislo he dislocated his shoulder. That's right. Um. Well, he is going to impact himself. So well, then, because he's still got one arm, he will pull out his hatchet. Go right there. That's all I can. Start off. Uh, might as well do something. I'm going to go for the guy that everybody else is going for. That's worth it. One. So a twenty. That'll hit. You can stop. He's okay. just a fucking schmear on the ground. He's done. And I didn't move. Oh. So. Yep. I'm gonna go for the guy from Zach. Uh, you can't do anything else, actually. Read failure to stop. Oh, yeah, it's a full round action. You're right. My bad. All right. Preach. Good old basic going to Nemesis. Yes, sir. My turn? Yes, yes sir. It is. So, again, he's going to get the... Well, fuck. Uh, what is it to unjam my weapon? It is a dex. Is it a full round action, or what is it? It's an action. But because this is melee range, he would get a reaction if he chooses to use it. Okay, so just a straight dex? Yep. It's unjammed. Uh, roll me... A quick deck save. Fuck it. Oh, well, I was going to give that to you, but oh well. Um, you take four bludgeoning damage as you unjam your weapon and look up to take a solid right hook across the schnoz. That last damage? Roll was eight just damage. four. He basically just punched you across the muzzle. Oh, He's getting double tapped. 84 damage. All right. Uh, you get one, two, three hits. Oh, not that. <laughs> <laughs> and roll me one more damage roll. And then bonus action, popping a stem. All right. Wow, that's trash. It's still 10 HP. Uh, 
Rockets his turn. All right. He will. He will do this. I don't know what this is. Um, he hits you with his um, special attack type deal that he has. Um, with his actually still one existing hand, if you look at his picture, um, for 13 necrotic. I don't get a save. Or, yeah. Yeah, actually, yeah, sorry, you do. Yep. Save for half. You save for half, which would be six. Um, as he's as he's been doing these kind of like things to you though, preach. It makes it's weird because it makes your chest hurt. Okay. Does that make sense? So that was one of his actions. He will use one of his other regular action. Um, he's swinging with his sword. You do get a reaction against this if you want. Um, you manage to catch his sword just enough with essentially the flaming blade is like right above your face. Okay, very well. Um, and then as a legendary action, he will hit you with this. Charisma save. Okay, you actually made the save. Nice. Um, you take 12 psychic damage and uh, nothing in your mind breaks. And no, psychic damages do not force you to injury. Very well. All right. So uh, these guys will come into here. He'll step in here, and he's going to pop around off at Zach and miss because he sucks. Won't talk about that guy. <laughs> oh, this guy will go in here and he's going to do Can the same. He hits his buddy behind me? Uh, he didn't miss by that much. <laughs> okay. You have an 18 AC, he rolled a 17. <clears throat> it, it hissed as it went by. This guy also misses. He did roll well enough. You may roll the D100 if you so choose. Will. Uh, misses his buddy, but only just. Mm. Um, guy up here. He's got a long way to go. Go there, and then this guy will step here in the opening and see Odloff. He will go to shoot Odloff. Odloff, you take nineteen ballistic as he crits you. So minus fourteen. And flash R one D one hundred plus at twenty from the last one, so give it to me with thirty five. Hmm. Uh so as he hits your shin with the round you fired a little early though it hits right into the shin bone causing it to splinter out as you take a compound leg fracture <clears throat> so you basically are not able to move because it's a leg huh. um you can still do everything else as long as long as i can do everything else i'm okay with that Brutus is down. Zach. I... Fuck, that's right. Brutus is down. Uh, well, first I mean, thing I'm going to do... People left him in dying is quick, so yeah, Brutus is down. <laughs> do you need to stimpack Brutus? I'm stimpacking myself because I'm damn near dead too, and I don't want that. Okay. <laughs> and I guess the last thing I can really do is shoot this guy. Yep, for one. Kind of love that ball pop stuff. Roll the two damages. 
14, 11. That's a 25. All right. Good and good. as a free action, I'm going to shout to Shiza to catch the guy who is running outside with the box. You shouted that to Shiza? <laughs> OK. <clears throat> I just got this image of Shiza laying on the ground, pointing at her ankle, like, what the fuck am I supposed oh, to do? Oh, yeah, have? that whole thing. I forgot about that. I'm going to shout it to Olaf. How am I All supposed right, to move? <laughs> <laughs> Compound uh, fracture to my leg. Oh, Shiza? Got the well, he said he, sh he yelled it to Shiza for, so I'm... Okay. You know, like, drag yourself outside to see if you can see him? Yeah, pretty much. Uh, which way did I see him go? You didn't. <laughs> I just said go outside. Okay. All right, so I can uh, crawl at half movement, right? Mm-hmm. Ah, stop. There we go. There you go. And I guess perception as a bonus action? Yep. Twenty-five or twenty-six. Don't see him. Out of game, that's because he's actually not in your line of sight. Yeah. In that case, right. uh, second action to craw keep crawling this way. <laughs> All right. It's actually that guy's turn. You're gonna keep taking off into the desert. All right. The guy that stepped up to Zach with one arm and a hatchet. Wing it with the hatchet, you do get a reaction for melee combat. Zach? What's up? Reaction? Uh, fuck. I'm trying to think. Pulse, I'm gonna try it again. Alright, only, only that counter. Oh. oh my god. Alright. He gets no damage on you. Roll the crit. As you crush his testicles for eight damage, he has no sack. The hatchet, and he just falls to the ground, holding his nuts, and he goes, "What the fuck?" <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, sucks to be that dude. Odla. Failure to stop on O Peckerwood. It's through the door. All right. So I could shoot the guy who just lost his ability to have children, even though he's probably going to die. I'm going to I'm going to let Zach take care of him. Yeah, it'll hit. All right. Is that failure stop one? Yeah, that's failure stop one. Fill that up for me. I will. Seventy-four. All right. He's gonna roll a hefty injury. All right. Ninety-three. Uh, oh, good job. Um, you blew his knee apart. Well, I am laying down, so that does make sense. <laughs> they're both, they're both, you guys are both laying down. But he's blocking the doorway. Um, yeah, I actually want you to roll me okay. a second attack. Okay. All right. With it real quick. Okay. Doesn't happen. That was to see if I, I you rolled the second half. I took half of the attack. If it had hit the guy behind him, the round would have gone through that guy. Oh, hit the guy behind him. that would have been great. Okay, I that see what you were doing. Yes, sir. It's your uh, turn, bud. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and get my out of the way. Oh, it's a little better. And 
going to get uh, uh, the fucking switch move. Well, you didn't jam. I'll tell you that. Okay, so how many hits did I get? You get two. He does get his reaction, which he is going to use. Okay. Uh, his reaction will be the void thing. It sends the rounds to another realm. All right. Well, that was a one. So. Uh, and that one, none of those hit. I will actually give you one damage roll. Okay. Out of which one? The the second one. All right. He'll take six and... damage. I'm giving you that one because he reacted, but his arm is still like right in front of your fucking gun. So. All right, and then quick reload, and he's gonna get another. All right. Wait, you used your bonus action. What do you mean? Him. Uh, reload's a free action. Oh, nice. So Mavi, one damage. All right. And none of those will hit. Very well. All right. Gracchus' turn. He will hit you. Swing, swing. Um, reaction? All right. You managed to parry the second one for no damage. The first one hits you for... 14. 11 slashing, 3 fire. You are putting up a hell of a fight. Yeah, you are, bud. Trying to. You're, you're doing really good, actually. Um, Alright, that's his turn. This guy. He's gonna shoot Zach. Full action. Of course. I mean, you're right there. Yeah. All right. It's um, literally just me and you in this room. You take 15 ballistic. God, okay, let's see. Minus. Oh, God, I did it again. <laughs> All right, you good? Yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah. You, you got that figured out? <laughs> <laughs> All right. So then that the other guy, he's going to do the same thing. Of course he is. <laughs> <laughs> one of them will actually miss. The second one will hit, though. 14 ballistic. Guys. I've got, like, two hits left on my vest. Nice. That might be what you need. All right. Uh, so the guy behind the dude who's now falling on the ground. <laughs> Difficult going, terrain. Um, not quite. Uh, he is going to pull his gun up, and he is going to shoot Odloff with it. Reaction. Uh, well, pick up no. his buddy that's dead in front of me and use it as a bullet sponge. I'll give you that one for creativity. So I'll give you a plus. I'll give you half cover for that. Okay. Okay. Um, so that means you get one, two, three, four damages from this gun. Oh, okay. For this a was... grand total of 18 ballistic. Damn oh, it. sorry. Actually, correction. 29 ballistic. One of those was a crit. Wow. All right. Hold and on. Guy... Okay. Plus, let's see, 35 from the last one, so that is... Mm, roll it. 
for me plus 45. Oh. Sucking chest flame. Yep. Hold on. You are incapacitated. One round, I start uh, death saving throws. Yep. Unless someone gets to you. Yep. Then I'm going to roll them up. Uh, this guy in front of you that you blew his knee out, um, he is basically doing the Peter Griffin. Mm, good. Um, Brutus is down. Zach. Yep. You. Going. Oh, yeah. Roll me a perception. All right. So, you see this guy right here, um, one of the guys that stepped in the room. He uh -huh. takes a round. She's a roll me a perception. All right. They're right there, and they're not being stealthy. Um, pretty much for the end of the combat for the guys that are not fighting Gracchus. Um, we're going to play that out a little bit more. Um, she's a, you see two figures, one a very massive figure, and then the other guy, kind of a normal human-like figure, run into the room. And um, Zach, this guy behind you, takes a hefty round, and he drops. Um, and as you look to the source, you can see your message was quite successful. Um, your buddy and his, his friend are coming to your aid. Ooh. Being said, we have to finish the fight with Ko and Garakis. I get one of these real quick. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So, Ko, you actually get to go before Garakis. All right, I'm going to go mute for a second. Uh, real quick. Mm -hmm. Um, after Ko's little thing, do you mind if I try to, you know, get that one guy in my line of sight and shoot him? Yeah, we can do that. Okay, after... Considering you, that have guy, a, go for. you have a range of 1,200 meters on the SMLE. Yep. I'm going to go smoke. I'll be right back. All right. I'm joining cool. them. I'll be listening in on the Gracchus fight, though. All right, Ko. Dude, I stayed up for a fucking Your turn? hell of a long time. Thank you. I crit on kicking balls the second time. Did you get my message? That, new guy. that will miss. And if you're talking, I can't hear you. And then he will be getting, um, the diddle. Uh, one damage. All right. Did you get my message, though? No, I have not. Oh, I sent you a message. You might pull this off. Ah, nice. Um, which changes the whole storyline if you do, to a point, but still. All right. Is there anything else? And no damage rolls for the second one. He will not burn his reaction this round. It is Gracchus's turn. And he will swing. And you do get a counter, and you block for no damage. And he will go for this again. Rolling that charisma save. Ooh. Do no. I get to re-roll it? You do get to re-roll it. You did not use your reaction. All right. Um, you take fourteen psychic damage. Um, and you are thrown five meters back. All right. And you are prone, but you do not take damage for being knocked back. And All it right. is your turn again. Uh, so I am going to. Uh, now, if I pop my armor boost, will that 
that doesn't do anything against melee. Does it? Uh, the armor booster is DR against any physical damage. So melee. Melee, ballistic, piercing, bludgeoning, now, slapping. What about my vest DR? Is that only ballistic? Ballistic, only ballistic. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and pop armor boost. All right. Uh, what? Is, that's an action, right? That is pretty sure it's a bonus. Well, then I'm gonna use an action to stem. Let me check real quick. Armor booster. It, yeah, it's a bonus. It doesn't say, but it would be a bonus because okay. you're hitting like a button on yourself. All right, well, I'm going to uh, use an action to stem. I'm going to hit the button for armor booster, use 15 feet of my movement to stand up, and then he's. Mm, he's going to get. Can I diddle him? Since all I did was stand up. I'll let you basically fire one burst off. You get one damage roll. One? One. For the 22 19. at the end. 19 doesn't hit? Nope. His AC is 20. Ah, very well. All right. Damn. That's a really solid roll for that gun. Okay. It is his turn. He's actually not, he's actually looking pretty rough. Um, and then he will drop. Oh, he'll actually step to you. And he will swing and counter. You do not counter. I don't? Nope. Damn. You did not exceed his attack roll. Um, and so you will take eight slashing or okay, from your DR none. I'm back. A little talk to myself thing. Five fire, so you'd only take three fire, thanks to your armor. Only three? It's physical. Wow. Ah. And he will hit you with. Christmas save? Yeah, definitely gonna want that. Oh, no. You take. You take 36. Well, I'm down. That's fine. Um, so, as he is okay. basically pulling on you, and your chest starts to hurt, it clicks exactly what he is doing to you. Pretty sure you can figure that out. Yeah, he's trying to rip my fucking soul. Let him rip uh, my fucking soul out. Well, that's the thing, Preach. Your soul is very heavy. <laughs> uh, he doesn't manage to get it out. Um, and then... He will, like, stop and seeing that you're, like, collapsing on the ground. Gracchus will kind of stand over you and be like, You fought like a younger man still. Admirable. What a mistake. Then he's going to pick you up. And he's going to tell you, I don't wish you any death, Oberhauser. I want you to see what I create. But I can't have this happen again. And he's going to drop you over his knee. And as you're laying there, you're going to watch him walk off at the back. I believe he's token. And more and more bricks start falling in. And as you're fading in and out of consciousness, the largest Kitsune you could swear you've ever seen in your life comes running over to you as you black out. And that will be in this. So how many rounds did that take? Um... For the fight between those two? Yeah, since when he when it went that way. Like three? Yeah. It was going to last a lot longer, but his last soul drain, he critted. Oh, damn. Yeah. Uh, Just, so, okay. 
I just have to tell you this, Preach. He is a boss level character, right? Like, he's supposed to be really hard to kill. At 185 HP, you alone brought him down to 50. Those Christmas saves were what killed me. Yeah. Um, but we can stop the session or we can, and you guys can do the RP, we can do the RP stuff in our RP channel. Um, uh, wait. The mask? The one that she Oh, does. that's right. Thank you. Yeah. Um, she's a roll me perception. Okay. Uh, do you want me to move first? No. It's been okay. long enough. He's way out there. Oh, okay. 25? Yeah, you can see him. He's about 1,100 meters away. Uh, shit. Okay, I'm switching to boss killer. Ammo. Uh, if you and take the time to switch anything it's... or aim, you're going to, he's going to ex get away. Basically, then I can't get that. him because I have to aim. You don't... So, I mean, I'm giving you the aim. Oh, you're giving me a you're one You're looking eight. through the scope to see him. <laughs> to okay. Thing here. Well, all right. So I got one aim. Attack, yep. And this is at your furthest range increment. Yep. Twenty-six. A twenty-six will hit. Roll me the damage. Please say that I've got sneak attack. Oh yeah, he's he's way far away. Mm. And I had shredder ammo. Twenty-seven. All right. So your round hits him square. You see him. Stumble, but not fall, as he keeps moving. But you definitely hit that fucker hard. And I can't get another round off? No, you cannot. Uh, with that, we can call it here. Yeah. Um, we will do the RP stuff in RP channel if you guys want. Are we heading back to town, basically? Yeah. Uh, essentially. Okay. Uh, Olaf, you are not...